bounds. What's up guys, Edition X here and welcome back to episode 11 of my PSV Eindhoven career, basically part 2 of the January transfer window as you can see. We are looking at Dromel, Godino, Eric Palmer, Brown, Tim Yedva and Joe Gomez and Tilly Munz. And look at Eric Palmer, Brown, he can play as a right back also. And a few of these play a few of these centre backs, excuse me, can play right back, including Joe Gomez. He can play left back, right back, centre back. And we will be looking to pick up these lads, especially Joe Gomez and Tilly Munz, and also a key part of our choice from them too. Cause that Dragoski has unfortunately gone to Ajax disappointing. He was a class keeper, but we're getting getting rid of dead old weight there. But until the game, Locadia drops it off to Maha. Maha waits for Brennett to run down the wings. And Brennett with a first time cross. Dipping header from Locadia. The big man scores again. What an absolute looping header that was. Goes to the camera with the bail celebration. A traditional bail celebration there. And then they are on the attack here. Lays it off to Bickle for Santos, Santos is waiting back to four, and four tries a little cheeky shot but goes wide and then they get a corner here and then they try to shoot and then they shoot here and Williams gets rid of it, Lestien on the break here, Locadia waiting for the big man Maha, Maha lays it off to Narsing and Prupa, Prupa smashes it off the crossbar and into the goal, what an absolute class finish from Prupa Leading the assists this season. Bickle on the ball. Narsing intercepts there. Great interception from Narsing. Prupa down the wings. Cuts inside. What's he going to do? Lays it off to Maha. Maha has a cheeky little shot. Unfortunately for him it just goes wide. And then we're on the ball. Maha again. He's been everywhere this game. Locadia lays it off to him. And then Locadia with a big boy shot. One handed save from the keeper. And then there on the attack here, Lundhold puts the ball out to the wings to Brenberg. Brenberg tries to cut in and then Lundholm comes in out of nowhere and strikes it wide. And then another shot from the big boys and he sees forward the shot this time and I think that was offside actually. Then a typical counter attack from us, Locadia waiting to pick off a lovely pass to Joseph Zoon. Joseph Zoon bombing down them wings, sweaties it and thank you for the rebound. Locadia scores once again, I think that takes his tally up to 5 goals this season in a short space of time. And then they do some silly shit here man, Joseph Zoon with a cheeky shot, he should have got a goal himself man because he just came on second half and he was just bossing it down them wings but Ruben Neves the big boy Ruben Neves and Prupa with the shot Ruben Neves gets it clear and it is full time our first win of the episode it is a big boy win 3-0 great win there and Ian Nacho complaining about the youngy spot and he wants to get in first team football in the next game and then we give Tin Yedva and Raul Godino their um transfers and Joe Gomez we tried to undercut them with Tillymans and uh, Yedvert but they was not having it to be honest we could not get them on a bargain because they wanted uh, 6.5 million for Tin Yedvert I think we sh probably should have paid it looking back at it because Atletico Bilbao the little sneaky bastards that are doing the Ajax and they want to grab him and unfortunately I actually think they do grab him to be honest but Leicester end on the wings tries to whip it in Back to Narsing. Narsing heads it on, but nothing comes to it. And Guadado with the big boy shot. But it goes wide. A bit ambitious from the lad since he can score them long range boomer goals. But Maloney slots it in to Shakin. And Shakin misses. And he was just a beast this game, to be honest, Shakin. Ruben Neves lays it off to Narsing. Narsing's waiting for a lovely pass there to Guadado. Guadardo with a big boy shot, tries to pull it in the top corner there. We all know he can do that this season. He has been scoring screamers, but fortunately for him, he does pick up a lovely goal. Keeper does get a hand to it. But Guadardo, the big boy Mexican, puts another one in the net. But at this point, they were just attacking like mad, to be honest. The second half, and on the folly, it's 1-1. What can you do? 
just the start of the second half they score straight away and then this I think this was a penalty but <clears throat> uh, this I will show you the replay guys and tell me what you think because this was absolute bullshit Hendricks getting screwed over there and this was not a penalty if anything this was a penalty no uh, not a penalty but if anything this was a free kick for us and they are going to Duplin is going to pull it in to the top left corner there big boy finish from him and we're losing 2-1 we was winning 1-0 man but unfortunately that's the way it goes to be honest and Shaq in turning like a beast and he was just slaughtering us this game to be honest he was beasting and feasting all one up saying Nacho with a big boy shot just goes wide that should have been 2-2 from Ian Nacho Maloney on the ball there Havnar waiting for Maloney and Maloney tries to slot it in near post what a sexy goal that would have been but unfortunately for us that is full time and you cannot do anything about them games it was just one of them cheese games where you could not just you could never win you you just can't win they were counter attacking all the time and yes and yes it has been confirmed by Leverkusen do sell Tinyadvat to Atletico Bill Bell. We pick up Joe Gomez there, left back, right back, centre back, versatile player, Codino there, and then we pick up Tillemans, the big boy, centre mid there. We get rid of Charles, he's dead weight, he's 32, we're not going to really do anything with him. And we get rid of Pazve there, we're not going to do anything with that lad either. But onto the um, quarter finals of the Dutch Cup, aka the FA Cup, and then the big boy. Shot from Prupa trying to replicate that goal that he scored, but that was an absolute terrible shot. I don't even know what that corner was, also. That was some woeful stuff from them. And then Gundos with the big boy shot and straight into the so poet's hands. And then Larson cuts back, cuts inside, gives it to Tillymans, and Tillyman strikes off the post. His first opportunity, and that was a clear penalty on Bergwin absolute clear as day that was and Ruben Neves with a beautiful through ball to Lestien what's Lestien gonna do cuts in and the big boy goal 82 minute there was not many chances in this game but Lestien that bright spark in the game absolute hero and Jezef Zun on the attack great control from the lad and hits off the bar off the upright unbelievable man absolute unbelievable then they get a um, free kick here and then it goes straight to keeper Le Locadia lays it off to Lestien Lestien is going to replicate the first goal that he scored and thank you we are into the semi-finals of the Dutch Cup and we are going to go on to win this thing what a beautiful thing this is and it is full time we are into the semi-finals of the Dutch Cup and as you can see also AZ have managed to pick off our upset against Ajax but I'm going to end the video right here guys don't forget to like comment subscribe and I'll see you later and then we call for a free kick here and guys this was absolute fantastic play this was all me boy this was all me we're running to the camera and you know what time